YouTube, what's up? It's your boy Crypto J coming at you guys with yet another Detox Crypto. If you're new to my channel, hit the subscribe button as well as bell notification. I do my best each and every day to give you guys the top picks in cryptocurrency. And guys, nothing has changed. Nothing has changed. We want to talk a little bit about Bitcoin uh, because, as you guys can see, they made their uh, rate announcement yesterday, and they decided that they were not going to change the rates um, until further news. And so, as you guys can see. Uh, our bull flag was playing out here. We had a small pump after that because people thought, okay, well, if rates are gonna, you know, stay high, maybe that'll be bullish for Bitcoin. Money print is gonna go, but your boy Crypto J was already telling you guys that there's a good chance, guys, that we do need to see another retest. I don't think quite yet that this uh, retest has fully happened, uh, and I, I think that this will probably be a fake. We did talk about the fact that uh, Thursdays are usually a real day of price action monday's not necessarily the real day um so we'll see kind of what happens maybe we could find somewhat of a bottom for bitcoin or maybe bitcoin will start slowly recovering right we start creating somewhat of a double bottom down here and start heading its way back up but again guys not not super likely just because again shoulder head shoulder this was a bearish play and then again we have a a bear flag playing out on the on the one year chart so um this could still be very bearish play so um, just be careful again if you're trading in some of this volatility. As you guys can see, the uh, market cap coming in at 215, and today our fear greed index reading 47. Like we are going down significantly. Just in March, we were at the 93. Today, we're at a 47. Just yesterday, I think we were at like 56 or something like that. But I did say that our accumulation zone would probably be down here or maybe even down here somewhere. Um, it's really hard to say, but again. Having does not usually indicate the top of Bitcoin. It does indicate that we're headed into a correction, though, and that's what I think that we're in right now. I think that we're in a correction right now. That's what I've been saying on my live streams. Again, if you guys not tapped in the live streams, you gotta tap in the live streams. But again, I want to talk to you guys about some meme coins, right? Because again, if you didn't, uh, if you weren't in on the video yesterday, guys, you missed out on some insane gains. We were in this, we uh, were checking this coin out at 10 million market cap, and as you guys can see now, it's at 43. Uh, and Rocky's just looking like a beast right now, dude. Rocky's looking like it wants to possibly uh, have another breakout, which is pretty crazy. I mean, we started following this thing. I think they only had like uh, a thousand holders or something like that. Now they have three thousand, um, and this thing is still pretty cheap on its way to hundred million. Man, why couldn't this have been Brett? Brit, right? <laughs> why couldn't Brett have hit a uh, hundred million this fast? Like, uh, I don't know. Um, and I'm not even sure if those projects are going to recover, Brett, which will be really, again, really, they're, they're starting to correct Bitcoin. So um, it's hard to say until I think Bitcoin starts going up. But there are going to be some coins, guys, that you can make some money in. Uh, you just It's going to be a lot harder to make money. It's going to be very few and far between. You guys can see Rocky creating a possible cup and handle here. But if it decides that it wants to reject off of this, it might create another shoulder head shoulder. And it might see another correction. It's really, really early to say. Um, but again... Possible zone accumulation. I want to see this thing continue to trend above this orange line, of course. Um, and then there was another one. There was another one that we were looking at just yesterday. It was Boomer. Look at Boomer, man. Boomer has crossed over the one, uh, the 1 million holders. Um, as you guys can see, coming in at 27 million market cap. It's starting to break a little bit there on the 5 minute. Let's see what the 15 minute is looking like. Yeah, 15 minutes looking like this is already starting to break down. So... Um, I don't, I, I would expect that Boomer has, uh, yeah, I'm not saying it's topped out because again, I don't, I don't know too much about this project. I didn't know that it was airdropped to one point to like a million people. Uh, but I don't know too much as far as, uh, you know, has this thing reached its top yet? It probably, probably has reached its top. Let's see if we can find another one. Um, what was the other one that we were looking at the other day? I'm not sure. Okay. But. Um, again, guys, this is why I tell you guys you got to be on the live chat because I talked about all these coins on the live chat. I think I talked about um, the first one on the live chat a couple of days ago. Um, but look at some of these coins, right? Some of these coins that we even talked about on the channel starting to pump, right? Trump coin starting to pump right now. As you guys can see, 31 million market cap. This could be bullish right here. This could be a not bad zone of accumulation for uh, Trump coin. Um, Definitely starting to see some price action starting to break up above this orange Bollinger Band. And this is a coin that, again, a lot of people might have some interest in, especially with everything that's going on right now in the world. You guys can see Trump coin up 55%. And this was a coin, guys, that we were talking about on the channel. So, again, if you guys uh, if you guys like that, if you guys like those election coins, 
Um, that might be a decent one. Seems like the Solana blockchain starting to see some positive price action again. I know that we did also talk about Mitchie on the channel. As you guys could see, Mitchie coming in at almost 100 million market cap. Who would have thought it? Are you guys holding Mitchie? Let me know in the comments. We 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 talked about this one a little bit. Um, and and remember, this is the one where it has the cats that can like dress up or whatever. Like you could dress up the little meme or whatever. Yeah, see. So again, I'm surprised Mitchie's coming in at 100 million market cap, but it, also not surprised because again it's it's this cryptocurrency so it's really hard to say also punky is another coin um that seems to be having somewhat of a decent recovery look at punky coin guys starting to break above some of this resistance punky coin coming in at a 63 million market cap with almost 40,000 holders this could also be bullish guys so um you know i'm i'm not telling you go out and buy anything of course when you're trading into bitcoin volatility highly volatile and highly dangerous right um, but I'm just saying like there is some money to be made. Uh, it looks like people are making some money in swing case. So also we can talk about PopCat, right? PopCat coming in at 561 million market cap with 42,000 holders. Uh, PopCat up also 40, 41% as you guys can see. PopCat creating this uh, little bit of cup and handle. And maybe this could be a bullish play for PopCat. But why does this chart look like this, man? This is crazy. I don't know. Is this, uh, can somebody explain this to me? PopCat coming in at number two on um dex tools let me know what's going on with popcat and also are you holding popcat or not a good project i don't know i don't really know we're just kind of really just skimming over a lot of things right now so um then we'll go and you know what we will we'll save the rest of these blockchains if you guys want to see what i think about the rest of these blockchains we're really going to dive more into these coins you got to be tapped into the next video so make sure you hit the subscribe button make sure you hit the bell notification i'll catch you guys next video peace